New on the night be parents of Pearsall Elementary students demanding answers tonight. They've heard of allegations of sexual assault from a student, but say the district has been silent. The night team's Bill Barajas talked to school officials who say they have nothing confirmed to share with parents. The end of the school day at Ted Flores Elementary was like several before, with parents wondering what's really going on after a student made allegations of sexual assault. Pearsall ISD, the city's police department, and child protective services are looking into the claim. There's a lot of questions that should be asked. Even though it's a possibility, we still need to know as parents. No information from the school has parents concerned. I actually talked to five in total because I did call the school and then I called the school district because I wasn't getting any answers from them. According to these parents, the students' claims were made back in mid-November. At least a call. At least a call. They can call us for so many other different things that they don't need to call us for, but at least a call notifying each parent. We went to the district to find out what was going on. They refused to answer any questions, but issued this statement. It has been very challenging to balance and respect the rights of all involved. I know that there have been a number of rumors and unfounded speculation concerning the district and the steps taken thus far. Ramon said confidentiality prevented him from sharing any additional information. The Pearsall ISD Police Department also talked to us, but off camera. They say nobody's been arrested, suspended, or even fired. They say these are just allegations and want to remind everybody that their children are safe. In Pearsall, Bill Barajas, KSAT 12 News.